So biochemistry is one of the most volatile subjects and it is the easiest subject that you might forget when you study in your first year MBBS. So these tips helped me to study in my first year MBBS for biochemistry and I hope this helps you too. So my name is Vikram Akash and I am a second year medical student and let's begin. So choose the right book that suits you. There are literally lots of books, good books for biochemistry and uh, you might be confused to choose between them. So always get recommendations from your seniors and professors before choosing the right book that suits you. If you can't do that, always download PDFs of various books and read those and come to a conclusion of choosing the book that needs you. So my choice of books was a textbook of biochemistry by DM Vasudevan. It was recommended by most of the people around me, so seniors and professors recommended it for this book. And it has clear concepts of metabolic pathways and these are given in an orderly manner and it's easier to understand. So that was the book I chose to study for biochemistry and it did help me a lot. So there are other Indian author books such as Satya Narayanan, it is also another good book and it is more easier to understand if you find Vasudevan as a harder book. And uh, coming to international authors, there are Harper and Lippincott. I personally used Lippincott for my reference book and Harper is also a good book if you have a lot of time and your love towards your biochemistry is more and you need to study a lot in your biochemistry and you need to learn from them. Harper is a good choice of book and that is the standard book that most of the people use to study. And it is a great book. So coming to tip number two, pathways and cycles. Since biochemistry mostly consists of metabolic pathways and cycles, you need to remember those first. So since these pathways and cycles are interlinked together, always start with an orderly manner and start from the first and then go on the orderly manner. When a metabolism or a pathway is asked in an exam, make sure you draw diagrams and flowcharts to support your answer. So this might help you to score more marks and create a better impression on you while writing an exam. Always study diseases that are related to these pathways and cycles. So this helps you to understand your clinical aspects more better. And this also helps your uh, understanding on wh why you need to study the cycle for the particular reason. So coming to tip number three, practice previous year papers. Since biochemistry is a vast and a volatile subject, you will tend to remember most of the things that you have studied in the, at the end of the last time. So, before starting to so read the entire syllabus and uh, please do read previous year question papers. Since these previous year university question papers are repeated most of the times, these might help you to score easier and uh, this might help you to pass the subjects more easier than you have ex ever expected to study biochemistry. So this might help you a lot when you read previous year question papers. There are literally tons and tons of resources to read from previous year question papers. You could go to Google Play Store and type it or there are lots of books that you can buy to read this previous year question papers. So that brings us to tip number four. Try making mnemonics. So mnemonics are nothing but easier words that are simplified to make you understand. So I made a lot of mnemonics in your first year of MBBS and these helped me to a lot to remember those better. So when you start to forget things, these mnemonics will come in handy when you are in an exam hall or stuck at a point where you can't go beyond a think thinking uh, of to find the, the solution that you needed. So during those times, these mnemonics come, come in handy and these might help you a lot. And I have experienced it over in various exams and various subjects. So try making a lot of mnemonics that suits you. If you don't feel like you can't create a mnemonic, Always go to Google and search for mnemonics and there are a lot of mnemonics that helps for biochemistry. So these helped me a lot when studying in first year for biochemistry. To tip number five, revise and practice as much as possible before your exams. So since practicing and revising is the key that, I'm going to, that is going to help you to score in your biochemistry exams. I have faced this in many exams and uh, this helped me a lot in for particularly in biochemistry that is revising. I usually don't revise it regularly but rather I choose a day where I go through the diagrams and flowcharts of the biochemistry. So this helps you to remember the key points that you need to remember and these are the most important key points that you need to remember. So when you do so you will not forget those key points and this might be also interesting to read and revise at the same time. So this does not put a stress on you and it also helps you to remember things that is more easier and clearer for, to study to need to study for biochemistry. So these are few tips that help me to study in first year and these help me to score better in my first year. So I hope this helps you too and uh, hope you enjoy the video and thank you for staying till the end. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.